The first thing that I do when I establish a relationship with a new patient is to try to understand a little bit about them. It's important, of course, to know their medical issues, but also you want to know a little bit about where they're from and what they do and what their needs are, and if possible, to see what sort of support that they have, family, friends, if they're new to the area, or if they've just moved here from somebody else. All of that plays a very important role in trying to figure out what kind of care they could need if something serious happens to them. Primary care providers are the people who can look at the entirety of the health care going on. They're not just the person that focuses on just one organ or one organ system like the heart or the brain or any other specific area. We look at people in their entirety and how those things that could go wrong interact. So if a person comes in with one issue, it may be related to another issue that maybe a specialist wouldn't necessarily know about or wouldn't feel comfortable treating. I have been interested in medicine forever and the field of study that interests me the most is internal medicine how things work within our bodies, how they interact when they don't work, and in a lot of cases, what causes us to be healthy when we do the things that we're supposed to do. I love teaching and I love treating across the age span. My best day ever was when I had a three-month-old and a 103-year-old come into the office. And it's that sort of diversity that you get treating all the different age groups that make it so rewarding.